I was sort of surprised when he asked me to dinner, because I know you're, like, dating Jake's brother and everything. Puck and I broke up. He dumped me when he went off to live at a college he doesn't go to. From a distance, Puck is super hot, but you don't really realize until you're right up close how puffy he is. <laughs> there you go. I don't know why I have such terrible luck with guys. It's probably because I come on really strong and pretend to be all slutty, and then I freeze up right away and get distant and drop weird hints that my vagina has teeth. But I didn't come here to talk about the razor-sharp barbs guarding my cervix. I noticed how withdrawn you got this week in Glee Club after you told everyone your secret. It may have seemed like no one else in that room understood what you went through, but I did. It was um, my friend Julie's older brother. I was in sixth grade. One night, Julie had a sleepover, and in the middle of the night, he came down into the basement and crawled into my sleeping bag. At first, I thought it was a joke. I didn't know what was happening. But then he started um, to feel me in places. In the morning, I went straight home without saying goodbye, and I couldn't tell my parents for a while. I was afraid of upsetting them or something. So when I did tell them, they were really confused. They didn't understand why I waited so long to say something about it. My mom called his parents, and all I could hear her say was how good of a kid he was and how she didn't know how something like that could happen. And then Julie stopped talking to me and told everyone at school that I was spreading rumors about her brother. And she told all my friends to stop talking to me. Finally, I just decided it'd just be easier to switch schools. So I did. I understand what it feels like to have something like that happen to you and feel like nobody understands. I guess I just wanted you to know that I do. Thanks.